After Fukushima, nobody thought that Japan would go nuclear ever again. Why are they now restarting old plants and building more? Good question. There was a lot of nuclear fear in Japan following Fukushima, and the government once promised to phase it out around 2030. But nuclear made up far too much of Japan's energy sector to be nixed completely, and the government eventually recommitted to the technology. In the past decade, 13 reactors have started back up, and many more are in the works. But wait, I thought the nuclear plant blew up and killed like 20,000 people. It's a horrible idea to put nuclear plants in a place that's prone to tsunamis. That's a common misconception. The tsunami is actually what killed 20,000 people, not the nuclear plant. During the disaster, there was an earthquake, which triggered an automatic shutdown of the reactors. But reactors are hot, so they need a constant supply of coolant even when they're not running. The storm made Fukushima Daiichi lose power, and their backup generators were in the basement, meaning they got flooded in the tsunami. Without power, the cooling systems failed, and the nuclear fuel melted and caused a hydrogen gas explosion. There were actually two plants closer to the epicenter of the earthquake that got hit with bigger tsunami waves, but they were both fine because they had their backup generators higher up. Damn, terrible design flaw. I know, and the government was so worried about people getting exposed to radiation that they ordered an unnecessary evacuation, which was chaotic and caused way more harm than the radiation could have. If the residents had stayed, they would have gotten less radiation than a CT scan. The unnecessary evacuation was estimated to have killed around 2,000 people, but none from radiation. That's awful. So what if there's another tsunami? Well, Japan learned their lesson. New regulations require higher tsunami walls, backup power systems on high ground, and filtered venting systems. But do people really support building new nuclear after all of that? Well, public opinion has shifted significantly over time. As you can see in this poll of Japanese people, they've grown more in favor of nuclear in the past few years. Energy security is a major factor. Today, Japan generates about 80% of their electricity from fossil fuels, despite having virtually none themselves. Importing all of this energy from overseas is expensive and it's risky. Yeah, relying on your neighbors for all your energy needs does seem like a bad idea. Not to mention the climate impacts. Japan is committed to carbon neutrality by 2050 and solar and wind just can't do it alone. I guess nuclear does make sense for Japan.